what's up guys? This is Andrew Smirsek with Combat Training. Today's video we're gonna be talking about backup guns. Now, this morning I posted a picture of my EDC, my everyday carry, and people went crazy over two things. Number one, the Rats tourniquet that I carry. So check out my video on the Rats tourniquet and why I carry it. And number two, the fact that I carry two guns. Now they were saying stuff like, oh, if you fall in a pool, you'd never be able to get out. And, Oh, you need to stop watching so many movies. And, uh, oh, uh, oh, if you need all that, you need to get out of that neighborhood. Well, if I fell in a pool, I'd be just fine. I can swim, and I'm also, you know, tall enough where I can pretty much touch anywhere I go. And number two, uh, I don't really watch movies that makes me want to carry a gun. I watch the news, which right now especially, is clear evidence as to why you would want to carry two guns. And number three, <clears throat> I'm just fine with my neighborhood. And honestly, I don't put myself in situations where I think I'd ever need a gun. Uh, and also, those are liberal talking points, and there's never any logic behind a liberal talking point. So, good job guys, and I'm sorry I carry too many guns for you. Now, let's talk about the logic as to why you would want to carry two guns. I carry my first pistol, right? Because that's the gun that I'm gonna go to if I have to protect myself, if I have to protect my loved ones, innocent bystanders, or anyone else, right? I carry it to save lives, should I need to. Now, if anything went wrong with that gun, I can switch to this gun. So, if I wanna do a faster, uh, a faster reload by just drawing another gun, or if I get some sort of crazy malfunction, it's easier to just draw another gun. And if I had to, I could give it to someone else, okay? There's a lot of people who don't carry a gun, and there's various reasons. Uh, maybe they haven't gone through and gotten their concealed carry permit, right? And check out our website, combatertraining.com, take care of pistol one, you get free Florida Concealed Weapon Permit Certification with that class. But some people don't have that permit yet. Some people think they don't need to carry every day. Some people are just being lazy. But there's actually a lot of competent people out there who should be carrying a gun that aren't for whatever reason. If I had a competent person near me that I could arm, I would want them to be armed so that they could help me, so that we could eliminate the threats and save lives. <laughs> but, again, I don't necessarily think I'm going to need it, but I'd rather have it than not have it. And then the other thing is people say, like, oh, that's got to be crazy uncomfortable. Uh, guys, I use the SOE, the Special Operations Equipment Rigid Cobra Duty Belt, two-inch belt, super thick, stiff uh, scuba webbing. And I have one gun on this side and the other gun on this side. So I have a rigid belt and one gun here and one gun here. So it gives it equal dispersion of the weight and equal opposite points of tension. So it's actually more comfortable than just carrying one gun. So, all right guys, hey, thanks for watching. Hey, also, you wanna see what guns I'm carrying? I'll show you right now, I do it every day. First, I have my Glock 45 on my right side, and then second, my backup gun is a Glock 19. Yeah, every day, and it works for me. You don't have to do that, right? And, but keep in mind, it's better to have more gun than less gun. And I wouldn't advise a full grown man to carry anything smaller than a Glock 19. I do it every day, you can too. All right guys, thanks for watching. Be safe, check out my website, combatartraining.com. We have rifle slings for sale for only $25. They're mil-spec materials all metal hardware, all components made in the USA, and I sew them. I sell a lot of them on live stream, so check out our Facebook too. And then again, check out our classes, and remember, discount code RATS, R-A-T-S, to get a free tourniquet with a class. And remember, most importantly, train saves lives.